What's up lads and welcome back to Star Trek New Horizons Into the Mirror Darkly As the Federation, yes I can actually say um, Since last week That we are playing as the United Federation of Planets And actually it's quite exciting times Because we are also not that far away from integrating our Vulcan brothers into the Federation And then it's most likely going to be the Denobolians and once all that is done, I think we've got a very nice amount of territory. We most likely will be joining the coalition together with the Bayesians and the Soren League. And just making sure that we have all of this going um, against the Romulans who actually have a lot of stars in a very close proximity to another. So that's going to be quite quite strong also we still have to find the um, the Klingon Empire who's most likely over here with the Orion Nebula so many things that we can still do looking very much forward to that also change the names all of my um, leaders now have uh, names from people in the comment section there is still a, a good amount of people on the list no worries it will happen eventually give it time uh, for now, we're still waiting for all of these rulers to become, up, uh, well, imp well, not pissed off anymore. This is Xenopher, man. Come on. Come on, man. Also, we need to take a quick look at our governors because I did notice that that one didn't have a, uh, a governing type. So, there you go, Aaron. I'm not going to be looking to the traits as much with my named leaders because I don't want to get rid of them uh, and by the looks of it yes we are going to get another guy over here so let's recruit actually I quite like the influence production here um, Bizarre Gamer is going to be the name so let's take that Bizarre Gamer there you go let me make sure that I have change that in my naming list let's see you go away uh, yeah 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 okay uh takes forever i know i know i know relax there you go bizarre gamer is in yeah one name of the list influence production plus 10 hey i'd say that's uh, that's good so let's on pause let's take a quick look because we got a lot of things going on with our planets uh, some invitations to get rid of that. How is our stations doing? Because we're building them up. Naval logistics. What what else can we place around here? That would be... Well, the Orbital Museum actually is something I would like to get. But since the Federation just formed, we are going to be quite busy making sure we get close or somewhere near our naval capacity and we got a lot of ships to build this will actually bring us way over so this one fleet will be sufficient for now let us go with the the first fleet because this is not the second so let's do it like this the first fleet here we go what is this starbase level two i like that hmm. let's go with the production of dilithium because we consume a quite well a great deal there's a coalition invitation between those two which is quite nice i'm actually quite i'm hoping that the game is running smoother now i did upgrade my um my my ram i know it's not why the game is lagging but i'm hoping that this will at least um, help a tiny bit so we got tractor beams now for our destroyer ships Ooh, yeah, this is actually quite interesting. We're still making 31 trained officers, so we know we don't have to go for the uh, the holographic training simulation right now. But the burst phasers is is quite interesting. Speaking of ships, let's take a quick look. Can we do anything with it? Now, actually, we're we're staring away from these, so we're going for light cruisers. I quite like the one now with the defensive. They will take down your your average torpedoes. I thought this would get the tractor beams. Huh. Maybe it's just the explorer. Uh, is it the grappler beam? Oh, here we go. There we go. The tractor beam. This is uh, 
Is this a destroyer class? I think this is more a cruiser class. Damn, that zooms out really fast. <laughs> Sorry for that in the background. Um, oh, we got a bit of a power issue. I would like to get... Well... Hmm, power will always be a thing on these ships. I, I was struggling with that in the past. So, yeah. As long as I have the... Um, the all of the uh, the best options on these I'm okay with it so let's go with save the NX design and we need to mm. you you don't have a naval logistics and I'd say we go all out and try to get as much as much unity as possible and uh, we still have to upgrade all of the bases, but we'll do that once we have a um, a larger fleet. Because that is a bit of a thing. The Cardassians are stronger, and we don't like stronger. Let's go with the torpedo launcher. And because let's take a quick look here. They are bloody overwhelming, I hate that. So everything is just going straight into alloys, making sure we are... Oh yeah, they're starting to rival each other. Oh boy, we also need to get these planets going. We have more than 200. Yes, we do. Let's get these. Let's colonize one planet. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. What is going on there? There is something. Do I have a scientist nearby? There was something in here, wasn't there? Uh, rescue in progress. Special project. Let's finish it. I've been really down with this. Um, I, I need to pay attention. Scientist in orbit. Let's go to... Where is this? It's all the way up there. Oh, can we manage? You know, it is interesting, right? Let's see. You, you are nearest. Go here, research that project. Please be careful because... Oh, wow. Um, you'll get pushed out by the Romulans. They don't want you to be in their territory. And I, Well, I can imagine. I wouldn't mind. I don't like people in my territory either, so uh, yeah, can imagine. So up is down. The USS Enterprise, the NX-1, passes through an asteroid belt on its way to the H-1, uh, to the W-1HAT. Science officer, Imperial, the science officer, Imperial Inquisitor, reports that the ship experienced a number of sudden gravitational shifts. Ever curious. Imperial Inquisitor, in Inquisitor dispatches a number of probes to scan the debris field to descend the causes. It turns out that the culprit is a number of gravitational, of gravity generators of old alien make, sprouting, uh, sputtering on dying energy sources and with their, oh my god, um, polarities inverted, the occasional sprue reverse gravity into the void, throw not enough forces to cause any serious harm. Uh, not anymore. The science officer Imperial Inquisitor theorizes that the generators once provide artificial gravity for a large asteroid in the belt. Some of oh boy. Wait, really? Is, is he already there? I can't imagine. I thought this was the NX, actually. Uh, but he isn't. Oh well. Okay, dude. So let's go and put you back on automatic exploration. We don't care about that. Hopefully it won't take us too long with the uh, the Vulcans. We're making five influence. Not bad. Not bad at all. Uh, rivalries with the Ferengi. Uh, let's see. Can we get more alloys? Orbital Museum. We already own that one? No, we don't. However, we do not own any planet in the system. Okay, so we need to pay attention to that. Orbital Museum. Yeah, I like it. Pushing the frontier by 5%. Really now. So we might need... Oh no, we we'll actually are going to get a base in here. Uh, once we actually have enough alloys, which will be eventually. Not going to say soon. Every time I say soon, something will come up me and bite me. Because it's been so long. How long will it actually take for these guys to stop being annoying? Uh, two more years. 
You are still growing. But you're so slow. Growth base speed reduced by 0% due to the population newly colonized. It makes no sense. <laughs> in all honesty. And we even have the population growth speed boosted. Damn. Interesting, I guess. Yeah. So here's an insectoid worker. He is quite happy. I can't change that anymore, which is okay. Yeah, we'll have to see. Maybe we can actually boost those insectoids. It's it's funny. I, I, I really enjoy that. Look at this. The Romulans are actually not as strong as the Cardassians, which frightens me quite a bit. Well, we have to uh, remember that we do have a more fleet than we actually uh, see. This is ours, but all of our member states, they, they have the same amount. So it's actually quite a bit there. We all have around 1,300. But still, so much going on. Uh, can we boost the fleet? No, we're actually doing the colonization thing because that is more important. And I know, actually, can we do one of those insectoids? No, we can't. Yeah, max district, negative 50%. We might be able to change it eventually. I'm not sure, but I'm going to grab it. Maybe we'll just uh, put on research. Because it's such an interesting anomaly. The title look. Oh my. Very, very important. Now, I would like to prepare to have our sectoids do anything. So, after a long time... Oh, man. Kashia, um, uh, Kreska O, yeah, okay, it's it's worthwhile. Come on, mate, you 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 can do it. You can do it. Go here. Let's go. That's not how I want it. Um, apparently I lost the captain. There you go. So you, uh, research this project, and then you can go. You can do this. Just just be happy. You're you're. Representing the Federation, let's review. We are on 78. The high intensity negotiation should be enough to get the uh, the Vulcans in the next time. So hopefully that's going to be this or next episode. Yeah, we've got a lot of things to do. We need unemployment and we need it badly. Uh, we need energy, we need foods, we need minerals and... Yeah, well, okay on that. I want to boost my alloys up to 200 if that is possible. Let's on pause. Construction ship itself. Yeah, we actually could go towards this planet. It is large. A wonderful performance. So, with all of that done, can we... No, we're lacking influence. Wow. Is it that expensive? No way. We're lacking 51. Jeez. Okay, because we're skipping, we're most likely skipping this one. So let's go here, build over here, and we'll uh, we'll get all of this going. We can't clear out these uh, anomalies, which is uh, quite annoying. Hmm. How are you doing? Kick from the coalition? I don't want to. They're adequate. They're wow, why do I say adequate? There's no even a a, a and a D, and it is equivalent. Sometimes I'm, I'm, I amaze even myself. So the Sulek are superior, which would be failed. quite nice. Is this correct? We still have the trade deal, right? For how long? Ten more years. Okay, ten more years, that is. Uh, diplomacy, trade value increases, or ship building speed... Going into home territorial fire rate plus 25%. Considering that we are bordering the uh, Cardassians, um, I'll, I'll go for this one. <laughs> and I want that firing rate. Oh boy. Yeah, we definitely need to um, increase the amount of uh, unity. Did I send in this guy? I think I did. Yes, I did. Initiating communications. There we go. Trade deal with those guys. I'll take it. Who are they, actually? They are right here, aren't they? Oh, wow. Uh, we could form a research agreement. Let's do that. Let's uh, try to be more friendly to others. Uh, the Soren League, or next is the Sona Command. Mm. 
Mirab, his sails fell. Yes, I, I, your sails fell. That's great, man. Rule great. Of acquisition number 34. I love those guys. Where is that empire that we actually are doing business with? Uh, they're not too... Are you... Damn. <laughs> you um, have some interesting face, mate. Is it you? No, they're not. They are... A subject. Ah, oh, you're imperialist. They, you don't like me at all. We can actually integrate them. Shall we integrate these guys? Um, I... Wow. Whoa. It will cost you 131. 10 influence. Let's do it. Let's start integration. Uh, they won't like it, perhaps, but um, I would. Oh, this might be a mistake. Uh, we're still losing now. We're losing four, which is not as bad as it seems, considering it's for uh, 13 months. So that would be just over 40. Yeah, 48. No, no, no. That's not 52. There you go. I can't count. Oh, look at all of this. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful unemployment. Let's pause it for a second. So we need uh, food. Sure, let's build food. We need to increase that, but we can. This is actually not an unemployment. How long will this ruler be annoying like this? So less than a year. Meaning we might... She will probably go into specialist. That's actually quite nice. So we don't have unemployment then on the planet. We still have one job. So we don't have to do anything about it. We have no available jobs here. This is a new colony. Um, let's boost some more food. Let's do that. Yeah, why not? Uh, we also should start clearing tiles. Because I'm really someone that should do that. <laughs> because I, oh, yeah. What can I do? Um, did we just meet the... Oh, there we are. Oh, the Klingons. And they are at war with, um, with their neighbors. Oh, who's winning? Wait. Okay, I was worried there for a second that they would also uh, be at war with the Vulcans. That would be bad. We don't need a war. We need to be at peace uh, for this project to continue. So, let's close you. Colonization ship is on route there. They can actually do the, uh, the heritage building. Or the, uh, the museum. We're actually getting 103. 52 months. That is still a lot. And we can boost out a lot more. And we should. Uh, we don't have a job available for when you actually become obsolete. Hmm. I'd say we do want to get some more money going. Yeah, we might want to go and do the sector things. Now, there's, there's little we can do. We can put it onto balanced, uh, which is actually not too bad. Uh, they won't do anything because we don't have stockpiles. A rivalry has ended between the Kardashians. That is uh, perhaps worrying a bit. They are equivalent. We could declare war. If we would declare war, we can actually do the uh, ide uh, I oppose idealism or whatever it's pronounced. Ideology? I ideology. However... I had to promise that I should not go into wars right away. We'll try to do this the diplomatic way. Because we are the Federation and we do not oppose war to other empires. Because they just, well, have a different opinion. Mm. Yeah, this will produce some strategic resources. The Tyrellium D. And I think I do need it. So let's go take it. Won't be too long until these guys are integrated, my uh, my subjects. Uh, speaking of integration, we are having these uh, these things. Evading hostiles. Passive, I like that. So how are you guys going? Wait, are you not doing this? I thought I was doing this. Really now. I was doing this. I I really funk, uh, thought I was doing that. Why am I not? Is it because I was broke? Such a dum dum. 
and we're going to be doing this um don't worry about this we are losing four to the integration so we can actually lose quite a bit more there we go new phases and new phases for our uh, point defense as well now oh, here we go let's do that and let's review and oh, it's oh they're at 90 for crying out loud that's uh, not good low intensity then and there's little i can do oh my uh i might have just did a bit too much let's turn this off yes i can turn it off i cannot turn it off <laughs> oh boy yeah there we go uh integration there we go the north star confederacy has been integrated into the federation and um, this would really should help out my influence um let's go with the uh production we are l doing less than 90 damn there we go the uh, the suns and we're over one. We're going to be downgrading this star base because we just don't need it. I'm not too interested in this uh, territory. Um, let's take a quick look at your buildings. You are losing amenities. Interesting, actually. You are producing food. Very nice. And you're producing manpower, which I say is not the most interesting building. I rather have it that you get this replaced with let's do the entertainment center and we have two unemployment and we're going to be smashing that into money so that should help uh, let's see influence is now on plus three all of this is still working we can't do this one it's a bit of shame that we were not able to do a better intense inversion of the Vulcans. Wow, you, um, your Naruto character is not doing too well. Let's get that subject is now completed. They might not like it, but it is just the way it is. The Zindi Council has closed its border. Why? Why? Why would you do that? Do you not like to be integrated as well? We can actually demand vesselization. Yes, let's ask them to be their vessel. Let's... Don't want to declare rivalry. We could declare rivalry. It's, um... It wouldn't be too bad. Yeah, still the lag is still there. Which is highly unfortunate. We're actually not doing too well here. Science ship. Construction. Our leader died? Well, we'll have to take another one then. And then I'll have to check the list again. I will do that in the next episode, guys. Let's take another... Let's take a look. So, we have you, we have you, we have one of you. So, it doesn't actually matter who is the youngest. We all go with the uh, the Noblian guy. And uh, someone will get a name assigned to that character next time. As for now, thank you so much for watching. Um, we did integrate a new empire. We started work on integrating not actually integrating vulcans but we're at 90 percent with the vulcans next episode we will have that done we're making free influence again and we need to fix this because that's a problem and we know it so thank you so much for watching hope you enjoyed i'll see you next time have a good one bye bye